Hello there. My name is Stipus. I'm from Denmark. I'm 44 years old. I am freediver, professional freediver, and I got a disease called psoriasis and rhitis. It's um, pretty painful, uh, but I'm having it much more better today than I've been in the beginning when this disease started. To make it a long story, a little bit short. Uh, a lot of you have been writing to me about how I'm living and what I'm eating, how I'm training to keep my sickness down. You can make a really big difference yourself if, if you want. Uh, it's not easy. It's easy to make the decision that you want it, but to bring it out in life, it, it's, it's definitely not a thing. So you have to keep to it if you want to do this. Um, but it's actually really simple. It's a lot of vegetables, a lot of breathing, and some <laughs> some yoga, and some uh, doing some uh, breath hold. Um, if I have to start from the beginning, in 2000 and what was it, 2001, the pain started starting in my f my foot, my feet. Um, and in 2008, it was completely almost all over. My knees were so badly, it was so swollen all, all the time, I, I couldn't walk. Uh, and in 2010, I lost completely everything, my job, my company. Um, I went on a pension. <laughs> it was yeah, pretty heavy shit, actually. Um, In 2008, when the wheel, all of the wheel stuff really started, it was uh, everything just changed totally. Um, I was suddenly walking around with sticks, I could walk maybe 100 meters, that's it. Um, if I have to do something with my kids in a fun park, or just been walking a little bit more than 100 meters, it was, it was in a wheelchair. Um, so. Pretty heavy shit. Um, and in 2012, I've been in all the kind of treatment you can get, um, all this kind of medicine you can get from this disease. Uh, but nothing really worked properly. Something, it was working okay for maybe a few months and then it didn't work anymore. So every kind of treatment that you can have for this righteous stuff, then I tried it, but with no, no proper uh, outcome of it. Uh, in 2012, I was so tired of everything, I was actually ready to jump in front of a train and just said, fuck it all, and just, I don't want to be here anymore. Um, And, but yeah, I have kids, I have a nice girlfriend, I, it's a stupid thing to think like that. But um, and you, if you have pain the whole time, the whole day, it's not easy to yeah, find it easy just, well, why the fuck should I be here? Um, but yeah, my girlfriend, she keep on telling me about a woman uh, that her name is Alma Nissen, if you can look her up, do that, Alma Nissen. Um, she was back in the 40s, 1940s, she had a disease also, a righteous disease, and she was uh, only eating vegetables. Um, it was only potatoes, I think. Yeah. And she, she was, yeah, she, everything was starting to turn around for her. And uh, I think why not try the same thing? So I changed my diet completely. I don't get any meat at all for six weeks. 
I was only drinking water. Uh, you have to drink around one liter water for every 30 kilo of weight you have. So I was having around three liters of water every day and only that. And then I was only having vegetables. And it was not just tomatoes and stuff, it was kale, like a lot of kale. <laughs> uh, and my stomach turned completely mad. But after a few weeks it's fine again. Uh, and then I start, started panayama breathing. Because all of this, I quit all my medicine and I quit all the painkillers. I was on pure morphine, uh, methadone and something called gabapentine. And when I quit that, it was, yeah, it was quite terrible. Um, so I needed something to get me more well relaxed. And uh, Panayama breathing was helping me a lot. Um, you can also find the Panayama breathing on app. Uh, it's, it's, you're breathing in, completely down, fill your lungs totally up, do a little breath hold. Breathe out again, nice and slowly, do the breath hold again, and just keep on continuing doing that. Uh, I will probably make another video in a few days where we can talk about this way to breathe and I will show you some more techniques. Right now if you want to get started, you have to change your diet, start with that. Um, so, Quit all the way you're living and start only eating vegetables, fruit and some seeds and that's it. Um, and continue doing that for at least six weeks. Um, if you want some more knowledge about it, there's a thing on um, Netflix called uh, Fox Over Knives. It's, yeah, it's just saying everything also. I think that that will be it. Uh, thanks for seeing this and see you soon. Bye bye.